Hopping on a Zoom call with Jake Hurwitz and Amir Blumenfeld is a lot like listening to an episode of their long-running advice podcast, If I Were You. Despite being based on opposite sides of the country, the two friends, business partners, and creative collaborators never fail to play off one another, improvising the hilarious kind of bits that turned their eponymous web series, Jake and Amir, into the crown jewel of College Humor's library of digital content. You're simply along for the ride as they conjure up jokes that are constantly being reincorporated throughout the conversation. Jokes that make you laugh hours later during the transcription process. As a fan, hearing all of this unfold in real time is a rather surreal experience. It's not just an act, these guys are the real thing. Natural born performers, and damn talented ones at that. It doesn't take a genius to see how the side-splitting duo were able to strike out on their own with a successful podcasting network, HeadGum, which currently boasts dozens of original audio programs, and two spin-off projects, Gumble, a podcast marketplace, and HeadGum Studios, a venture that develops new podcasts and seeks out talent to host them. In short, Jake and Amir are a pair of coy renaissance men. We're little business boys. We can't help ourselves, Hurwitz says during an interview about his and Blumenfeld's latest effort, a new dating app called Orion, which can trace its origins back to 2013. We had so many questions, on the podcast, that were very Tinder-focused. It felt like over the last couple years, we just give so much advice around dating apps and how to chat and how to meet people online. Along that entire time, we've been saying, we should make a dating app. We shouldn't be giving these guys all the free press. Created in collaboration with Jeff Carbine, web designer for HeadGum's Not Another D&D podcast, and coded by Craig Silver and Don Naylor of 1630 Design, Orion has been in the works for the last five to six years. Yeah, quick turnaround, Blumenfeld jokes. What sets the app apart from its army of competitors, Tinder, Hinge, Bumble, etc., is what Blumenfeld describes as a personality-forward interface. Users build their profiles, not just with personal photos, but also with general images that give a better snapshot of who they are. Each photo is preceded by a specific prompt, which encourages the individual to put more thought and meaning into their collage. It provides you not with one photo and a bio to explain who you are, but rather nine pictures, Blumenfeld explains. Not just of yourself, but your favorite pet, your favorite moment, your favorite food, your hobby. It gives you a nice cursory glance at who you are over the course of this 3 by 3 grid. Once two people match, the app helps facilitate a more natural conversation with different prompts. Think Quiplash or Apples to Apples.